Understanding the rules for required minimum distributions can help you make your money last in retirement. Required minimum distributions, or RMDs, are exactly what their name says. The minimum amount of money the IRS requires you to take out of your tax-deferred retirement plans every year once you turn 70 and a half. Understanding the rules of RMDs is so important, because if you don't take your full RMD, you'll face a 50% tax penalty on the amount you didn't take. Here are the rules. You generally have to take your first RMD by April 1st of the year after you turn 70 and a half. For the years after that, you must take RMDs by December 31st. If you push your first RMD to the year after you turn 70 and a half, you'll end up having to take and pay taxes on two RMDs in one year. There are some exceptions, however. You don't have to take RMDs from your current employer's 401k account until you leave that job, unless you own more than 5% of the company. And while you do have to take RMDs from Roth 401ks, you are not required to take them from Roth IRAs. However, in both cases, the withdrawals are tax-free. For more information on required minimum distributions and how you can make your money last in retirement, visit wi65.org.